Hello again, everybody. Well, today we are going to do a little drive again. This time we're starting at the top of Lookout Mountain, which you will see here. And we are going to go out to the hang glider place. Now, I do have a errand that I've got to run out on the back of Lookout Mountain, so I am not just running out here willy-nilly, so still on lockdown, still doing the social distancing, all of that good stuff. So let's take a look and see what we can see. Right now we're driving through Lookout Mountain, Tennessee, and you can tell the red buds are definitely popping out. Actually, they're a little bit past, and that things look pretty amazing right now. Now this is Scenic Highway too. This was coming up past Ruby Falls. So if you ever want directions, you just follow the directions to Ruby Falls, keep coming up the mountain, and then just follow the way that I'm going. This is an interesting kind of complex that's right here. It's called the Commons. And uh, it's basically playgrounds, uh, soccer field, baseball fields, tennis courts, it's it's a, the community center, I guess you could say. And this is downtown Lookout Mountain. It's basically a line of stores. This is really the only retail area in Lookout Mountain. And you can see all of the uh, all of the stores right there. But we're gonna keep going this way. be driving very far on Lookout Mountain. All of Lookout Mountain is about 110 miles long and it starts in Tennessee and goes all the way into Alabama. Uh, if you go back through my older videos, you'll see some videos from Mentone in that area. But we're not going back that far. Just like that, we're in Georgia. Welcome to Georgia. Well, it's good for the GPS to catch up. Now, 
I don't know if you can see that off in the distance, but that is Covenant College. It actually used to be a hotel up here on the mountain. At some point in the future, I will be doing a video on it. I am just waiting to get permission to go up into the tower. And obviously with what's going on right now, um, that's not gonna happen till things get a little bit less intense. There's the entrance to Covenant College. And if you want to do more research on them, I cannot remember. They are Christian-based college. I just can't remember if they're Lutheran, Methodist, but they have been here for a while. that over the years the campus got bigger they have all down into here this is where their soccer fields are and whatnot but we're going to keep going interesting little thing that road to the left right there used to go to what was then a secret base secret military base uh, I believe that they handled transmission of things but I'm not a hundred percent sure it's been a long time since the base was alive it's now private property and where the families of the soldiers lived is right down here on the left um, if anybody knows you might want to comment on it below uh, but it was supposed to be a super secret base. Thrive, which is a retirement community, assisted living. Then you have, I think it's called Brow Wood. Yep, Brow Wood. And this is a private community out here. And right on the other side of those houses is the edge of the mountain. So I imagine that a lot of those people have a heck of a few. say one thing on these back roads back here 
while they might not be the smoothest roads, definitely it's a great view and it's definitely more peaceful out here. We come up into the community of West Brow. things get even more beautiful. The road does get closer to the edge of the mountain. And we're not too far away from the hang gliders place where I will show you the amazing view and then I must continue on with my errand. houses while they're really close to the road. I bet have an amazing view. Now normally on a good sunny day like this, although this is right after a storm, so the air may be a little bit choppy. Normally you'd see a lot of hang gliders floating around this area because we're not too far away, but I imagine they are closed because of the situation that is happening.
here we are, and we're coming up on what's known as the alternate launch point. It's launch point number one. And then a little bit further up is the hang glider place. So I'm going to pull over here. And we're going to take a neat little look. I will see you guys in a minute. Let me undo the camera. So normally you have everybody pulling up here and they're unloading their gear and they come up here and they set all of their hang glider stuff out here and put it together. Well, that's a shame. Apologies for the wind as well. They appear to have gotten rid of the really neat deck that used to be right here. person up there but here is what I'm talking about take a look at this view there's the launch facility at some point I'll come back when things calm down a little bit and I will really fully document this but down there where you see the line of little houses and buildings, that's the landing zone. So at some point, this guy will be landing lower. But it's a really gusty day today. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed our quick little drive out here to the back of Lookout Mountain. I'm off to go on some more journeys. So until then, why don't you go on a journey of your own? See you next time. Bye-bye.